I'm happy for him for giving us another shot. You know, yeah, yeah. Greg's story to me is, is so sad because the potential was so great and immense. And to know that he was handcuffed by injuries is disappointing. So I'm glad he feels yeah. healthy enough to want to go out there and feel confident enough to go out there because people are going to crown him. And he put himself out there. And that, to me, yeah. says a lot of growth and maturity. Now, listen, I, I'm with you. I, I'm with you 100% on everything that Greg's dealt with. But the question is, would it make me want to watch the big Thank three? You. Stay focused. No. No, it's not making me want to watch yeah. the big three. You know what makes me want to watch the big three? What? Guys who had big-time personalities, big wing players. Jason Williams, did you watch the mm -hmm. White Chocolate. Right, those, did I did watch. watch. And then Jason Williams went down, and I stopped watching. See? Yeah. Why? So you're not watching anyway, and I know you're not watching. I wasn't you're watching before. Watching, yeah. before. Look, right. I watched you in the NBA. Why? Because you're one of the best in the world. Right. When you're not that, I can just go to YMCA and see the same thing, but right. just say, oh, no, but he used to be great. Right. You know what? Guys in the Drew League, some of them will be great. Some of them are great. Some of them will be. And you see the same thing in the big three. It's like, it's just a dated product. Do I want to see you old school player?